Hey everyone. All right, so I have stumbled upon a fragrance that I really am liking, especially for this time. Um, so what I'm talking about is the Black Opium. This is the green uh, bottle. Um, I don't know if there's different uh, ones, but if you just search Black Opium YSL, then it's going to pull up all of their different fragrance flavors. Um, so this one, I really couldn't find a whole lot uh, of information on it. The only information that I found was that the scent is warm, spicy, and has the notes of coffee, creamy fig or fig, and green mandarin. And that's literally all I get. And I've searched a few different um, sites. So this particular purse size bottle goes for $30. That's expensive for just a, a little amount that you get. But um, I love the way this smells. I love, you know, I'm sure there's more notes than just those three that are in here. Um, is it original smelling? To me, I think it is. Um, but I'm sure that there might be some uh, manufacturers out there that have maybe a few notes that are very similar. Um, but yeah, it smells really good. It does have that warm and spicy feeling. Not very vanilla. If you're not a fan of vanilla, this doesn't have really any trace of vanilla. Um, the coffee doesn't have any smell to it at all. I don't know where the coffee is, but I get the green mandarin a lot more than any of the other notes. Um, as far as it being warm and spicy, this is pretty much, I would categorize it as like a fall to winter scent. Um, and because it's definitely heavier, like usually warm and spicy fragrances usually, usually tend to go kind of heavy. So I would say I would pair this like for the nighttime and not the daytime. Um, as far as like age range, this basically has no limit. I mean, I actually smelled this on a girl who was in her teenage years and it smelled fantastic and it didn't smell too old for her. Um, it doesn't have an old lady smell. Is it feminine or masculine? This will lean pretty much in the middle, but more feminine. Um, so it's definitely got a heavier scent, but not so heavy that you're gonna smell mannish, okay? So it's definitely a powerful look at me scent. Um, it's not a shy scent or smell at all. Yeah, it's just, it's very energizing. And that was another word that they described this uh, particular fragrance was that it's very energizing. Um, for being so warm, it is energizing. And that's what I really love about it. It doesn't have like those boring, you know, vanilla or musk. I'm sure there's a musk in there, but again, I didn't get any information besides that. Um, and of course it came just like this and no box. So I don't know if there's any other notes, but uh, I really like it. And the exclusivity of it is not very high because you know, everyone is probably going to have this on their counter at some point in time. Um, but that's what I love about it because if you're researching, finding, you know, what smells good on you, you can go to your local mall or Ulta or wherever you go and you can check it out and you can see if it works for you. You can get a sample. It's just, it's really easy. But in that case, you're going to find that it's not unique. You know, you'll probably smell like the next girl that's next door to you. So um, that I don't really, I don't really, I like, if I'm going to buy a perfume, I kind of want it to just be mine, you know? Um, so that's why I kind of stay away from big, 
name brands like this. Um, and if I do get one, it's only in a small size bottle, not a full size bottle because again, I mean, this is like, you know, nighttime, it's for a certain season. This is way too heavy to be in summer and spring. Um, so then it would just be sitting on my shelf, like just sitting there. Um, so right now, if you're looking for something for right this second to last you all the way through January, maybe even February, this would be a wonderful scent to pick up. So anyway, I can't say anything more about it because I don't know anything else about it. Only that the fact that I'm loving, loving the way it smells. Um, it doesn't give me a headache even after wearing it all day. I don't get bored with it, but I'm sure the more I smell it, the more I spray it, probably will get bored eventually, but that's why I got a small bottle. So anyway, thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next video.